las responsabilidades de las partes que en contravención del derecho internacional cometan asesinatos y mutilaciones, así como violaciones y otras formas de violencia sexual en contra de los niños, podrá ser examinada por el Consejo de Seguridad. This is a landmark uh, resolution when you think um, the, the, of it is the only thematic issue on which the Security Council is so uh, engaged uh, and uh, collectively engaged. And I think we now in the UN system have to galvanize ourselves to meet uh, the responsibility of helping to implement this resolution. Children are killed and maimed immediately. This process opens up, but of course, a lot will depend on how the listing criteria uh, uh, about uh, you know the whole issue of intentionality is there, uh, whether there was the intention to to kill. Or there, there are a whole list of other issues concerning this, in which we are having discussions with lawyers uh, to see how exactly to draft the listing criteria. And with regard to Myanmar, I can say that, um, uh, well, there have been some positive developments. Um, as you know, the Myanmarese government has set up a, a committee uh, uh, and has been to some extent cooperating with ILO in releasing some children. Uh, that uh, it has found in its uh, midst. Uh, we still um, are not sure how comprehensive that is and the extent of it. Uh, and so I'm uh, dispatching a team um, and this, at the end of this month. We'll be going to Myanmar. <laughs> Thank you.